Hi, my name is Femi Temowa. I am uh, an artist, a producer, uh, a musical director, and an educator. I think one of the uh, misconceptions about being an independent artist is that you're not successful if you're not being lauded by like a massive like conglomerate machine who have your posters, you know, sprawled all over the M25 or whatever. But I think it's important also to remember that um, when you started to play music, you know, whether you sing or you play an instrument, when you got involved in music, it was something that you saw as uh, a way of life, you know. Um, and, and for me, as an artist, I saw music as something I was gonna be doing for the rest of my life. So I never really saw it as this star that was just gonna shine, you know, really brightly for three years because I was signed to some major label and then disappear into um, nothing. So I think it, it, it's, for me, it's a, it's a, it's a lifetime's uh, uh, work. It's a lifetime achievement that I'm looking for um, as an independent artist. And I think that if you, if you uh, see yourself as somebody who can be making music well into 60, 70, 80 years, I mean, some of my favorite artists are in their 80s, you know, um, then you should be encouraged by the fact that success is not just about being signed to a major label. You can um, do a lot, um, even now, especially nowadays where, you know, technology and the internet and so on it's so, it's so it's so open to us in my i guess role as a as a producer and a music director i've often worked with artists who um, some have been signed you know to major labels and have been completely swallowed up by that machine and i think what i've often found with working with people like that is that there is so much less creative control that they have and I think it's important as an independent artist to take heart and take courage in the fact that you can actually say exactly what it is uh, that you want to say, musically speaking, um, and know that you can still be equally successful saying that. Um, in, in fact, in some ways, the success is greater because you're speaking for yourself on your own behalf rather than being told what to sing, what to play, and what to wear, and all that kind of stuff. I mean, you know, if, if you find that you, you're, there are areas in which you're weak, then you can of course bring people on board to strengthen those things. But it's important that you can grow um, as, a, as, an, as a, to remember that you will grow and can grow as an independent artist.